Hey everybody, how you doing there? Um, this is going to be some carpo math for what it's worth. I've actually not been a big mathematician all my life. I've uh, avoided it carefully during school. Um, I've always enjoyed numbers, but I failed math every year uh, because I didn't do my homework probably. I remember my teacher coming to me saying, you passed the tests, why don't you do the homework? But um, anyway, math math itself has never interested me as much. When I, Once I got, I never got past uh, I think I got into geometry when I was out, but uh, since then I've probably learned mm, tenfold more, you know, since I left high school, and uh, <clears throat> I'm more fascinated with numbers that pop up and speak as kind of a language, if you will, and I'm going to share something with you guys that I found. Um, a lot of people will scoff and say that it's just chance, and others will say, oh yeah, I've seen that or heard of that. Um, I found a pattern in pi that just, blew, you know, just kind of, I don't know, I kept going back to it. My idea the other day was I was thought, okay, pi is 3.14. So I thought, how can I memorize, you know, get, you know, improve my memory? I thought I'll start memorizing pi. So I was like, 3.1415, uh, see, then I start losing, 3.141592, Eight nine seven nine three two three six. See, that's it. Anyway, um, oh, there it was. Yep. I wrote down this stuff, and uh, I had memorized it out to about the twentieth decimal point, and I started finding these patterns. And um, after doing a little bit of research, I thought that this would be a pretty prominent thing that people would know about. Um, so it means either that it doesn't seem to mean much to people or that people just haven't realized it. And I googled and googled and googled and I could not find any information on this until I finally found one web page by a guy who had made, uh, uh, wrote in a book, I can't remember the guy's name, it's called The Matrix Numbers or something, and he mentions this in there. So at least I'm not the only one, and I'm not crazy. Um, you've got the 3.1415 and it goes on and on and on down the list. Got in here a ways and I started finding this, uh, because since I was memorizing it, memorizing it in, in pairs, then I started seeing these patterns that would pop up you got 79, 32, 38, sorry that looks like an 88, but 79, 32, 38, 38, 32, 79. So it's a direct mirror reflection of this side. Um, that's a pretty strange thing to come up in the first 20 digits of pi to me. I mean, I find that to be very, very, it, you know, <laughs> it's either completely nothing or something important because the only other two that pop up uh, as a double digit repeating number there are 26, which also shows up here. See, they're not within the pattern at all, and they really have no relation to it. But what I did find out fascinating was the fact that this 26 lies directly in the center <laughs> of these mirror image ones. And then the other 26 is over here. It's almost as if there's something to learn from it. And um, the reason why I'm presenting this is I'm hoping that somebody out there understands this better than I do. Um, or there's a mathematician that can either say this is just all chance or that this means something since pi itself is the um, Pi itself is the pattern when people talk about patterns of pi um, pi is the pattern and I've seen people who have dr drawn out pi on a graph and um, You know color-coded different numbers and tried to find patterns and it, it just seems totally random until the whole thing comes together And then it seems to be a pattern in other words the more numbers in a sequence you have, the more it seems to fit a random sequence. But you'll find more patterns in it the larger the number gets. So let's say you increase the pi to the thousandth digit, you're going to find a lot of similar numbers in there. Of course, there's only nine digits, right? Or ten digits. So um, <laughs> when I got to this one, it just blew me away. Kind of interesting. It looks like a little candelabra now. Anyway, <laughs> so... I guess I'll just leave it at that. And anybody who has any insight on this, um, I'm sure somebody's going, oh shit, I never saw that. And somebody else is going, oh yeah, I've seen that and it's nothing. But um, anybody who has insight, please uh, let me know what you think of this and why do these patterns repeat in a mirror image so perfectly? But it's not like 793238 and then it would be like 8323797. It's the actual double digits in a row, which makes it even stranger to me. So. There it is.